Hello everybody, today we are going to see how we can implement ACL access control list in a Cisco router. Uh, before implementing ACL, we need to know <coughs> uh, how many types of ACL are there. There are two basic types of ACL. One is uh, standard ACL and the other is extended ACL. In the standard ACL, there is only and the source but in the extended ACL there is the source there is the destination and there is the service that we our protocol that we have to implement uh, anything on we will be doing ACL in this lecture with respect to uh, the security purposes but the main purpose of ACL is not security as some uh, of the people uh, know about it but it all it only provides a list uh, of IPs <coughs> so let's start first we will be making the network on which we will uh, be implementing it first there is one router and another router and then I will need a switch I will take a plug-and-play switch and after that I will need some end devices a lot of end devices one two three four five six and this eight okay these are this on one side and a generic PC here and some other devices ten and eleven then use the connection cables so zero and serial zero zero and then use the straight cables to attach these ones Ethernet zero and fast Ethernet one, fast Ethernet, fast Ethernet two, fast Ethernet three. Since these devices are in trough uh, interfamily, so we are using a straight cable instead of a crossover. Cross through, sorry. And Goes all the connections and to make all connections. After that, we will be coming back to our main scenario and we will be connecting this to and then this one and this one. And this one, this one, and the last one. So, as always, I will start by giving IPs to one by one first to the PCs, and then I will go for the configurations on the routers. So, 200 or 200 dot um, 50 dot 4. Hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot uh, sorry fifty sorry dot hundred that will be the gateway address that we will be configuring on the router so assign the IPs accordingly two hundred dot hundred dot fifty sorry fifty dot five two hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot hundred And the next hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot six two hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot hundred and the next two hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot uh, sorry two hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot seven two hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot hundred and the next 
and the next hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot nine two hundred sorry two hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot hundred and the next dot hundred dot fifty dot ten hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot hundred and the last one on this side 200 100.50.11 now on this side 200 dot uh, no sorry here it would be 100 because it's an another metric but one hundred dot hundred dot hundred and hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot four hundred dot hundred dot hundred sorry for that and the next would be two hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot five Two hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot hundred and two hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot uh six two hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot hundred and the last one on this side two hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot Seven two hundred dot hundred dot hundred dot hundred. So there goes the IPs, and now the configurations. As always, we'll do one by one. Go to enable. Configure terminal mode. Host A. And then interface zero zero because we know it's administratively down. Give IP address two hundred dot hundred dot fifty dot hundred. 255.255.25 sorry 255.0 and then no shutdown and the link will be online and exit then int serial 000 then apply IP address 1.1.1.1 and 255.0.0.0 and then no shutdown and that's for and the next will be now and enable and then configure terminal and after that we will do host name B and then int FA00 sorry and after that we will apply IP address 200.100.100.100 sorry uh, I forgot the subnet mask zero no shutdown and link will be up exit int serial zero 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 and then uh, first of all clock rate since it's a DCE side clock rate 64,000 and then IP address 1.1.1.2 .1 .1 .1 and then no shutdown the link will be up and running and we also have to configure router rip and then to show IPRO sorry and then net 1.0.0.0 and then at 200.100.100.0 that goes for repon b and let's also activate rip on uh, router rip and then to show ipro and then at 1.0.0. .0 .0 zero 
and then 200 sorry net 200 dot 0 and there goes the configurations on that now if we want to verify we will ping this this PC 0 0.1 so we can verify 200.100. sorry 100.100.1 first time it will be lost but the next time the status would be reply yeah there you go so we are communicating and that would be the network and we will be using this network in our ACL uh, videos and I will break down this lecture into two parts the first in which we have made this network and in the next I will show you how you can implement ACL on this network uh, so I will be back in a short while take care bye